Hi everyone, and the objective of this video is to work through a question related to Norton's theorem. So the question is asking us to uh, find the Norton equivalent circuit for the following arrangement here. So we have a 3 ampere independent current source for a 2 4 ohm resistors and a 6 ohm resistor and a 14 ohm resistor. And the terminal pair that is supplied for this question through which we find the Norton equivalent is A and B over here, where A is connected to these 4 ohm resistors and B is connected to the 6 ohm and 14 ohm resistor. So in order to begin, let us find our Norton resistance. So to find our Norton resistance, what we need to do is we need to eliminate all the independent um, power sources. So in this case, we will be eliminating the independent current source by applying an open circuit where the current source was. And so therefore, to find the Norton resistance, we look at the current flow from terminal A to terminal B. At this node over here, the currents will split. And so <clears throat> one path through which we can get from A to B is through the 4 ohm resistor and through the 6 ohm resistor, like so, so in this kind of a loop. And alternatively, we can go through this 4 ohm resistor and the 14 ohm resistor here, and so through this loop over there. So therefore, what this shows is that the 4 ohm resistor is going to be in series with the 6 ohm resistor. It's going to be 4 plus 6. And the 4 ohm resistor is going to be in series with the 14 ohm resistor. And these two are going to be parallel due to the fact that 